Hello there. Hello there indeed, one and all, it is I, your Star Wars dad, here with another, we're here to talk about 5v5 Grand Arena and getting ready for it, but first do the liking and subscribing and make your family a better family today. I don't know why I'm on the Bronzium screen, but I am. So, let's talk about this, guys. I have moved up, my Nooch2 Hyper account is going on 7 months old, not quite there yet, and previously I was in Carbonite 1, you guys all watched me, uh, kick tail and take names in, in Carbonite 1. I moved up to Bronzium 3. I moved up three levels. Now, I don't know if it just automatically pops you into the mid of the next tier. It's been a long time since I climbed a tier. I've been sitting in a Rhodium on my main account for a long time. And uh, anyway, so, so yes, I was in Carbonite 1. I jump up to Bronzium 3. Now, some of you might be thinking <clears throat> that with my activation of the, uh, of the Executor last month, that that was the reason I moved up. But, oh, nay. Nay, my brothers and sisters. Uh, note here that my previous defense, both my defenses were Negotiator. I did not have the Executor at the time of Grand Arena sign-up. And so, what we're going to do, and I told you guys that I was going to be working, you guys saw me unlock the Executor, only get to level 72. Well, today, boys and girls, it's at level 85. It's a four-star Executor. So I'm going to put this thing on defense, and, and, and I'm really just thinking through. i got to add a couple more teams on defense. We'll, we'll go back out and look at it in a second, but this is the main thing right here. The executor, my friends, my brothers and sisters, is going on the, def the defense. I've only got two reinforcements, but I think, I think coming into Bronzium with the executor on defense is going to make people's lives really, really difficult. Now you can see here, I've got to add two more teams. So I need five teams on defense. That means I need to beat five teams on offense. That's not including ships. Let's talk about that. I I currently have I currently have my CLS team up here. Now, the, Leia will get replaced with with Chup, Chupio now. So that's a much better team. My question is, do I am I going to put it I hate that. I hate that it makes me do that twice. My question is and down here I got, I got Qui-Gon with the Omicron. What am I going to put on defense in these tiers? And let's take a look at let's take a look at my squads I got available. And this is where you got to think about stuff, you know? It used to be just three teams. I move up to Bronzium. Now I've got to put five teams out there. It makes a significant difference. And I've got my Grand Arena squads. Well, here are the squads that I have for Grand Arena. And we'll, we'll count them afterwards. I got Palpatine and Vader. Maybe even Vader solo, but Palpatine and Vader. I got Wampa. I got my Bounty Hunter team. Fully Relic Bounty Hunter team. You, you get that up for uh, for the Executors. So there they are. They're pretty. They're, they are pretty. That's it. Look at that. Relic 8. I like to get a bigger relic on on boss, but I don't have it yet. We'll work on that later. My Imperial Troopers, I need to get I need to get Dark Trooper relic. My CLS squad, actually, yeah, that's the right squad. I kind of want to edit this. <clears throat> I think that Chewie actually needs to go first. So when everybody assists, uh, they go in order that they're placed. And I want see Chewie's basic. Chewie's basic. Inflict, inflicts tenacity down. And I think that's what I want to go first. And then after that, we get Chukyo. Here he is. And his basic inflicts accuracy down. Is that right? Evasion down. Well, I guess they both kind of go hand in hand. Uh, let Chukyo go first. Okay, we want evasion down first. And then we want the tenacity. All right. Because All right. he's not going to inflict any debuffs anyway. He's going to... All right. All right. There we go. And it's going to give R2 a better chance to stun... No 3PO yet. So there you go. You got the Qui-Gon, Omicron. See, I got. I now have pa a, a low-level Padme to put up. This is not a great Padme team. Not a great Padme team. It'll probably go on defense as kind of a sec, a backup. It kind of impacts my Ahsoka decisions here because, you know, Ahsoka is on both of these teams. Do I need to save her for that? I, I probably can get by with just Qui-Gon and, uh, and Anakin here without Ahsoka. We'll take a little closer look at that, look at that later. I got my Geos. I've got my Iden Versio Troopers. Not a great team, but just somebody you can, you know, you got You can't go into light against that. Um, the uh, my I got a I got a Beskar Mando team here with some scoundrels. So again, not super special. And then just the, there's just a couple throwaway teams here at the bottom. Just a couple throwaway. Let's go. Let's move myself up. Move over here so you can see the teams at the bottom better. Like and subscribe, everybody. Um, yeah, it's just these throwaway clones. So what does that give me for? Let's let's say that. 
let's let's count this best guard mando as a real defense i don't think it's a super defensive team but at least it's a gear 12 best guard mando he's got his leadership that that's the one i chose right leadership zeta. yeah so um it'll no it's not his leadership zeta yeah well i got the other zeta on there um let's count one two three four five six seven eight nine ten so if I just go down to Beskar Mando, that's 10 teams. Now if I put five of these teams on defense, and you got to think that one, two, three are going to be out there. If I put five of them on defense, it leaves me exactly five for offense, and that worries me a little bit. I kind of want to have six teams for offense. And the offense teams I'd like to save, this one obviously, Vader, Wampa are offensive teams. Bounty Hunters might go on defense, uh, and uh, Troopers, CLS, that's four. There's five offensive teams, six offense. I'm going to put take my Geos on offense. So, I'm going to I'm gonna put it one trash, complete trash team on defense. Now, here's the deal. Here's the deal. I'm really counting on Executor to hold me. So, I might be able to hold back another team on offense. I'm going to remove the squad. We're going to take that off of there. Move. Oh, I gotta click the X. All right. So what I'm gonna put up front, I'm actually gonna put my bounty hunters up there. Let th so this is on the bottom. But let's back out. Let's. I know I gotta click like eight buttons to back out, which is annoying. But you don't have any. Uh, yes, I know I don't have any defensive squads. I know I don't have any defensive squads. Thank you. So the reliance, my reliance on defense in Bronzium, is gonna be right here, the executor. Now, obviously, guys, uh, you know and I know, I don't go out there and do a lot of oppo research. I'm not that guy. Um, for me, the 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 investment versus the reward, it might help me one out of every 20 battles or so. Otherwise, I can just field the right teams. I can I can look at a person's roster and get a pretty good idea, right? Like if they have executor, I'm still putting executor out there. I don't care. They got to show me they can beat it. Uh, and most people are going to have profundity down here. Most people are going to have like executor and the malevolence and the finalizer counters. They're just not going to have it if they're playing at all. So I'm going to rely on the executor up top. So I'm going to fill this se sector with some some low level slash garbo teams. My two best defensive teams I want to put right here. So I'm going to put my bounty hunters. That way we, we try. What we're trying to do is we're trying to block off the bottom. Okay, we're trying to block off the bottom. And then rely on the executor to hold the top. Again, maybe. Well, say yeah. Let's. I don't have a, that many. D or do I? I don't. But this one kind of fits. Revive a tank ally. Let's put that on defense. More crit avoidance. More offense. More protection. More protection on this team is great because Bosk's leader gives everybody protection. Uh, everybody 50% bonus protection and they all recover protection every time they title try to land the debuffs so there We're gonna put boss down there with the with the just we're just gonna make them make some kind of effort down there Now I've got Kylo Ren unmasked. I, I could this is a team I could put in there I haven't really worked in my first order yet, so it's not gonna be very good Troopers are offense. I'm gonna boy. What is this? What is that? That oh, how did it go over? There why did it not go to Grand Arena? I could put my CLS on deep. Now that has actually been a really good hold team. Believe it or not, even at these low gear levels, people have trouble with it down at the Carbonate One. There are people that couldn't get through that team or took three or four tries to get through. But let me look here. Then it would leave me with one, two, Palpatine, Invader, Wampa, three troopers, four Qui Gon Omi, and then five Geos. And then I just kind of got. Dumpy McDumperson for the rest of it. I don't know. I don't really like Padme as an offensive squad just because I don't have her Zetas. The team's not really up to snuff. It's not ready to go yet. Um, I had Versio's going on defense. What am I going to do here, guys? Uh, get to watch my thought process all the way through. I think what I'm going to do one, two, three, four, and I have to cobble together but most of my opponents are not going to put five super strong defense teams out there i think i'm going to put cls on the front line 
Um, why? Oh, I gotta take him off that top line. Hang on. So I gotta take him off. Oh. Back out. Yes, back out. Okay, so let me go up here to the top and let's remove CLS up there. In fact, let's just put two teams up here. Move squad there. So we're going to add... We're going to add some of these uh, chumpy squads. So I'm going to put... Uh, I'm going to put Padme up there. I'm a, I'm a little worried about Ahsoka. Let me pull up my Galactic Republic. I wonder if I might need... I got you. Who else is in my Galactic Republic? I don't think it's... Well, I could put fives in there. That would cost me my clone team. But... I'm just trying. I'm just trying to get a decent. I'm not trying to do anything special. My clone team isn't any good. So I'm gonna do this instead, and that leaves me Ahsoka to play with my Qui Gon Omicron team of Peter. I like this idea better. I like this idea better. I got a couple of tanks out here. I love how I love how General Kenobi comes to the front. By the way, so that gives me a couple of couple of tanks. Actually, three tanks, and then Yoda. Yeah, let's just leave that. That'll just be a squad. You know, you you can beat it pretty easily, but you gotta make a little. You, you can't just. I'm not to be trifled with. Let's add one more squad. I'm gonna put the best Garmando squad up there. I I don't know that that's better than Aiden, but I kind of think Aiden might catch somebody off guard. Or may yeah, I think she might catch somebody off guard in the back. So we'll put this up top. Am I gonna have enough teams if I'm doing? I don't. I think I'm putting too many teams. Now I'm thinking I'm putting too many teams out there the love of God. Uh, I'm going to add CLS here. I might... <laughs> That's cool. Again, you guys, you're... Wa now, why does it go back to Grand Arena on this one? Yeah, I'm going to put CLS here. That's going to happen. No, it's not! Alright, let's redo the whole thing. Boys and girls, you are watching this happen live. Live and in public. And look at my prestigious quests. I have... Um, I have to... Win 10 battles with Han Solo in my squad. Win 3 battles in offense with Han Solo in an undersized squad. I have to win 10 battles with Dartrea and undersized Dartrea. And I gotta win 10 battles with General Kenobi. So guess who doesn't go on defense? Han Solo, General... <laughs> All the things to think about when you're playing Grand Arena. Don't forget your prestigious quests. Let's change up this entire idea here. So, what we're gonna do is instead of instead of General Kenobi here, I'm going to put Ahsoka in. I realize that maybe it's not perfect fit because General Kenobi is going to do some tanking on the Qui-Gon team, but that's fine. I'm going to keep this team out. I'm not going to put... I'm, I'm, going, to, I'm going to remove that team. I'm going to remove the... Um, I'm, I'm going to remove Padme. I can use Padme as a secondary backup, and then we'll, we'll just put a, a garbage team. We're going to put a garbage team in. So what I'm going to put in is my feet. Just just garbage. That's going to leave me with my six you know, offensive teams. Here they go. Not a good team. I don't care. I'm counting on the executor to hold the top line. I'm talking out of both sides of my mouth this entire video, back and forth. You guys are watching everything unfold. So uh, here I'm going to add... I've got Aiden Versio in back. So right now I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven teams on off. I'm gonna go ahead and put the best car man on. So I got plenty. Why didn't that work? I'm trying to select a team, right? What am I doing, guys? You know, if you ever wanted to see, if you ever wanted to see an old guy trying to set defense. When 900 years old, you reach, look as good you are not, hmm? Well, this is your opportunity right here to watch an old guy try to set defense. Good lord! Okay. Beskar, Mando, and Phoenix are up there. <laughs> I I'm trying to keep a bunch of teams for offense just to make sure I've got it. So, let's put these guys in front. And we'll put we'll put a garbage team back. Um, got my clones, but I'm trying to save fives because he's Galactic Republic. Hmm. Let me, add, let me add up my teams again. One, two, three, four, five, 
six, seven. I need that seventh team. Can I put the G? I don't think the Geos are a great choice for defense just because of Vader and everything that's out there. So what I'm going to... I don't. Um, I'm just going to put garbage back there. Let's let's put some clones back there. Take fives off the team. And let's find... Do you have any more clones? I don't think I have any more uh, I wanted to, I wanted this to be I wanted this to be raw guys I wanted you yeah I don't have any more clones so let's find a Galactic Republic to put out there I want you guys to kind of see what I was actually doing your Plo can don't care I, I don't care I want you guys to get a feel for how to play on this out and what you're doing so up here is gonna go Iden Versio so up here we're gonna add Iden Versio and yeah it's not a great defense but I'm I'm truly depending on my executor to get me holds and or just make the other guy's life miserable uh so he has to go through it multiple times and then we'll come out and do some damage on offense so there you go guys my uh my my basically cheesed defense with my executor back there i'll review the other player defense to see what's out there this is my choice for moving up to bronzium setting my my 5v5 defense uh for this round of grand arena i hope you guys have a great day Come and watch me. I'll be out here for the first round of Bronzium 3 playing and playing also in a Rhodium. Is Rhodium 2 or 3? I think I'm in 3 right now. So uh, soon we'll go to Kyber as soon as I get Jedi Master Kenobi on that account. Guys and girls, boys and boys and hoisen, have a great day. And always remember, do good.